Working new details now in a story we first brought you last night at 10 o'clock. Federal investigators looking for the people who broke into an Army Reserve Center in Worcester over the weekend and stole weapons. New this morning, we've learned that more than a dozen weapons were taken. Eyewitness News reporter Madeline Wright has more in this story. She's live now with the very latest. The FBI is investigating how the security breach happened and working round the clock to track down those weapons. Multiple media outlets are reporting 10 pistols and six semi-automatic rifles were stolen sometime Saturday night. It happened at the Army Reserve Center on Lake Avenue in Worcester. The FBI discovered the break-in yesterday. The agency is on high alert in the wake of the terror attacks in Paris, but it says there's no indication the theft is terrorism related. Yesterday, investigators walked the perimeter of the armory, combing the area and taking pictures around the fence and barbed wire that surround the facility. The FBI is asking its federal, state and local law enforcement partners to help find the weapons. Massachusetts Governor Charlie Baker says all levels of government are staying briefed. With respect to anything that might appear uh, to involve any sort of a copycat or a follow up. These sorts of things people are going to be chasing and investigating no matter what. Officials have entered descriptions of the stolen firearms into NCIC. That's an online database law enforcement officers can search. Live in the newsroom, Madeline Wright, Eyewitness News.